What? Have you told them you've hit 70,000? Have you, like, celebrated? I or? put it on Instagram. Mm. Hi, okay, guys. Good. Welcome to our Thursday morning live show. We've got Anna in the house. I'm going to find you guys so I can comment because I can't read you guys all the way over there. <sighs> Anna, are you so excited to be here? Yes. Ratings are up. Ratings are up. Because you're here. Do <laughs> that. Okay. I gotta find my. I gotta find you guys so I can comment. Where is everyone from today? Watch. This is why it's fun. We can watch ourselves and then we can comment. Where? So oh, today. Right, you right there. Look. You right there. Those uh, you. Yeah. Oh. Ah, turn it off. Gotta watch the ad. It's always so dumb. Oh, we're watching it on two screens. We're like a big studio today. I'm Hi guys. I can't read your comments yet. Okay, here we go. Virginia, Cape Breton. Where's Cape Breton? You have your comments. <laughs> My ad's still playing. <laughs> Idaho, San Diego, Lake Charles, Louisiana. I don't know. Do I like Ed Sheeran? Who's Ed Sheeran? Myrtle Beach. Oregon, I don't like that. Missouri, you can read the comments. Texas. I like reading the comments. It's weird. It's like a time warp. Should I take the blue off the light? We're too blue this morning. I'm still watching an ad. I can't even get to us. Okay, so today Anna's gonna be making her craft next to us. She's just wanting to mod podge this A because she has done I've nothing. Had, with it. It's been sitting on my desk for so long and it's just boring. So. Yeah. So I was like, hey, come do it while I do my live video and we'll talk about fun stuff this morning. We are making a Friendsgiving banner and we're using paper as a stencil. So what we did was we cut out the pennants like this, enough to make Friendsgiving, except we did a little vinyl Mickey uh, Indian on this side and a Pilgrim Mickey on the other end, which I'll find him and show you him. Is he on there? Or I think, did she, I think we have no, to do him. him. Oh wait, we have a vinyl Mickey Pilgrim right here that if we get around to, we'll put on the other end. But we are just showing you guys how to use paper as a stencil and Cricut, not Cricut, this is glitter. It's Martha Stort. Martha Stort. <laughs> Martha Stort glitter and uh, Mod Podge. I love Martha Stort oh. glitter. I buy the whole pack and then you use the 50% off coupon. Plus, you wait till it's 50% off, then you use the 20% off the total purchase, and that's how you stock up on all the glitter colors at once. Pictorville, Lawrence County, Ohio, Mississippi, Texas, Indiana, Citrus Heights. That's like two minutes that way. Wow. Okay, so the first things first is you want to make sure that you're not putting your stencil backwards and you're also not putting it on the wrong one. So we're going to start on the very end. Can you guys see this? We're going to start on the end with the F and we're going to put it on our pennant and you want to make sure that your stencil is not backwards. And let's see. Oh, that's going to be so cute. Statesville. I know. So I'm wondering. So you're writing it in glitter. I'm going to do it in Mod Podge and glitter, yeah. So make sure it's good on there. And then kind of Mod Podge over the outside just a little bit so it holds that stencil on. So we just put our Mod Podge in. So this banner also goes with a banner that we made with faux leather leaves. And so I'll take pictures of this when it's all done and post it on the vlog so you guys can see it. And on Instagram and all that good stuff. I feel like I'm in kindergarten. We're like sharing on Mod Podge. We are sharing. <laughs> So we poured our Mod Podge into the lid so we don't have to dip into the whole thing and get glitter. Are you smart? What color are you using for your glitter? White. <laughs> Just white? White like Mod Podge. Nope. <laughs> okay. I need to be closer to my craft. Okay. As if we're not short enough. Right? <laughs> we're, yeah. So, Wales, UK. First timer from Hensley. Arizona, it's AR Arizona, mm -hmm. Arkansas. <laughs> oh, Ar no, doesn't that have a K? Well, I feel like it doesn't. Arkansas is A K, I think. So I'm just gonna Mod Podge over this whole letter and get it fully covered, kind of going onto the outside so that it holds that stencil down. And then, this actually won't take as long as I thought it would. And the reason we're using paper is because it's just less steps and way easier. And you could kind of reuse this if it doesn't get too ruined. So just make sure the Mod Podge is everywhere and it's not dry yet. 
And while it's still wet, you pour the glitter on. You use hairspray over it. It makes the um, glitter stay. Well, that's what the Mod Podge is for. You Mod Podge over this. I guess, but I'm just saying an extra <laughs> tip. So, that so you could hairspray over it. this if you want. But the whole point of Mod Podge is you do a layer underneath and a layer Whatever. on top. And then it, it's not loose glitter anymore. It's kind of like a sealed glitter. So we're going to get that nice and good in there. And then I'm going to take another layer. So I'm going to stay on this side and you stay on that side because I'm about to get all. Or just go all over. <laughs> now you're going to want to stay on the other side because I'm about to get some <laughs> glitter up in this side. <laughs> okay, so then I'm going to go over this with Mod Podge, which is going to seal our glitter in. And then I'm going to pull the stencil off before it's dry. Otherwise, this paper is going to be real stuck. So you kind of want to work fast. You don't want your Mod Podge to dry. Should I put it like... Oh, she is, so you're ombreing it. She's doing her do A. Gold and then black glitter. Sweet. You could do gold and then black and then go in afterwards with just a little bit of like hand done Mod Podge yeah. on each side so it looks like ombre. Yeah. But you don't have to, you could do like a straight line too. You do it as well. It's your crap. Or the thicker on the bottom and the thinner on the top. I don't know, because that it's thicker, so it's probably not gonna cover as good. Like you have to use more, but it's pretty. I like the thick. Should I do thin on top? You could do a thin layer of black and then a little bit of the thick on top of the thin layer so that it like fills in the gaps underneath it. Yeah. Does that make sense? That makes sense. Good afternoon. What time is it? It's ten o'clock. We almost made it by nine thirty. Is that when you said you'd go live? I try to go live by like nine or nine thirty. It's the morning show, Anna. You're right. I don't know. Okay, so while this is wet, and because we're dealing with paper, it's going to start kind of like bubbling a little bit, so you don't want to do too thick. I'm going to peel this off, and we're going to look at it. And then obviously it will look funky while it's not dry yet because the Mod Podge is white when it's wet, but then it dries clear. It's got a seal on it. I was sitting here going like oh, this. Good job. So then you can also pour some more glitter on this because it's glitter, it's gluey just on the F. You could pour more glitter on that if you think that there's not enough. Protection. protection of what? For your life. Protecting for your life. So I'm going to save this and see if we can reuse that again. And then I can have another. So Mod Podge is always kind of white until it dries and then it dries clear and then it'll be nice and glittery. And because this is paper, you could do this on faux leather, or you could do this on um, suede or actual leather or fabric even. These would be really good. But because we're using paper, because it's super easy to use and cheap, so that you can make it really fast for a Friendsgiving party, this is really, really easy. Do you have videos for CCR? What's CCR? I'm not good with abbreviations on the spot. It takes me a little bit. Jeez. From San Luis Obispo. Jeez. Slow. <laughs> what? That's what they call it. Oh. Slow. San Luis Obispo. S L O. Okay, Slow. Okay, okay. Got it. What is CCR? I don't know what CCR is. Um, I've never made it to a live before. You helped me learn to use my Cricut machine finally. Yay! You love my hair like this. I was just thinking it kind of looks funky. In that picture, looks better in real life. I don't know. What do you think? Oh. <laughs> they like it straight. It's kind of. I try. I'm trying out. What is it? Do you know what it's called? What I'm trying out? It's your hair. Yeah, that shampoo. Mm. It's the new thing. The new like multi-level marketing. I don't know. I don't know what it's called. It's called. I don't even know what it's called. I tried out this magic shampoo that you're supposed to be amazing with because I have crazy hair. Can you vouch for that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have crazy hair. I keep it on the DL. So the friends, you'll notice that there's the little piece. You want to save all the pieces to your letters when you cut out your paper in case there's something that, like an A or one of those little doodads. You could also do the reverse glitter effect where you could lay the letter down itself and do the outside glitter and then pull it up and the letter itself would show the paper through. That's a smart idea. Okay, let's see. So I got all the letters in here and they're in order. So I'm going to just put this. So what I was saying is that you could either put this down like this, the R, 
or you could put the R down itself and Mod Podge over this. Do you think I should do that? Or is that too much glitter? I don't want to waste more glitter for this one. If I was using faux leather, I might think about it because the more Mod Podge you put on here, the more it kind of goes because it's paper. Yeah, no, so you're I think, right. Yeah, I think I'm just going to stick with the letters this time. Be heck away. So, what's everyone doing today? It's a one week exactly away from Thanksgiving. I'm not going live next Thursday, but I will be live next Wednesday. And we will be discussing holiday budgeting. Dun, dun, dun. For like what, Christmas? How to budget for the holidays. So Christmas? Yeah, well, Christmas, New Year's. I guess Thanksgiving, it'll be the day after Thanksgiving, it'll be the day before Thanksgiving for like Black Friday. Mm -hmm. Not just like gift budgeting, but like how to save money during the holidays. I'm trying to get my husband up in here to help with that one, but we'll see. Monet. Just bought some stuff from Cricut. Yes, okay, Cricut has a two day sale. There's a link in the description below. I forgot to announce this. They have a really good sale. Lots of stuff is like super, super on sale right now. I'm listening and watching from work. Shh. That's the best place to watch. That's where I would watch. Okay, so I'm gonna try to read comments and finish this. Now that you guys know how to do it, it's that simple, that easy, and I'm super excited for it. What? I need a paper towel. You need a paper towel? You can go. Okay. I'll dismiss you. <laughs> it's it's not as bad when there's still someone sitting here. It's awkward when we leave them all alone. And then they're like, why am I just staring at nothing? So this one has a lot more to it than the F. So I got to work fast. So the Mod Podge doesn't, doesn't uh, dry. This is actually making me do like what I've been meaning to do. That's what I'm saying. Time. If you pop into the live videos, yeah, maybe I'll just do that. And you craft alongside what me, I've been meaning to do, like then we'll get some crafts done. I've got a lot of crafts I need to work on, so that's what I'm saying. We should just pop live videos on, and we'll just work on stuff with you guys, so we actually get it done. I wish there was like a way to do two-way live or something, so other people could pop in and be live. Is there a way to do that? Cause that'd be awesome. So we could work on crafts together. Google Hangout. Yeah. You can't be embossing folders for 99 cents. Nope, you can't. I don't know what we're talking about, but you can't beat that. <laughs> That's what someone just said. I think I'm gonna have to use a different brush for the gold because I don't want to get the black. Uh, yeah, good luck. We left all the our brushes at my house. So we were like scrounging to find good brushes this morning. I need new brushes. Hashtag real life. I have. I bought all those new brushes. They're at home, though. We used them on the pirate ship. Mm. All right, so I'm sealing this guy. Oh, um, it's hard to do this. It's hard to work fast and read comments. Anna, what's people saying? Um. Oh, you don't see them? She's not on there no more. No, because it's weird. It's like watching yourself lag. Right. You're like, what did I just do? Yeah, there's like a, what, how many second delay? Like a five or ten second delay? Seven seconds. Exactly. I think that's what we counted out last time. Remember when we did live videos? I think there is, but it would need to be through a different app. Yeah, to do like live togethers hangouts. That would be fun. Crafting together. All right, so last week we talked about favorite pumpkin pie or favorite pie because we were doing the pie banner. What's everyone's favorite dish? I think I talked about our favorite dish that we make. Have you had my cheese at broccoli casserole? No. Mine is green bean casserole. Well, wait till you have cheese it broccoli casserole. Oh my goodness. Stop it. It's amazing. Don't judge it until you try it. I'm allowed to like other things. Okay? I didn't say you're not, but I'm just <laughs> saying you're going to love it. It's the number one dish, and people are like, cheese it broccoli casserole? I've never tried that. And then I'm like, try it. And then they're like, it's my favorite. And then everyone wants the recipe, the whole big shindig. It's amazing. It's is really this blue? Easy. No, this is black. What? The See how I said? Little. Okay, so if you would have gone in. Littler ones. But if you would have gone in, you're going to just cover the big ones now with the little. If you would have gone in with little and then covered with big, it would have. Now you're going to have to hold, do a whole other layer of this eventually. It'll be okay. I know it will be, but just saying. Could have saved you a step. 
Okay, so this is like bleeding under this paper because it's not actually a stencil. So work your way from the outside into the center if you're going to do this. There we go. No I'm a lefty too. too. The Martha Stewart. Alyssa is so lonely. <sighs> Guys, sing Alyssa a song. She's lonely. Ooh, the eye's gonna be easy. I should do a De Vren's giving for my friend's giving. <laughs> my last name means the friend. It does? Yeah, it's the friend in Dutch. Isn't that a cool last name? Yeah. So another way you can do this is you can make up a concoction of Mod Podge glitter where you mix the glitter into the Mod Podge and then you just paint with it but it's not as like solid. It's kind of like more sparse glitter, kind of like nail polish. Does that make sense? Hungry. <laughs> I am. Anna has convinced me to try intermittent fasting. Which, taking breaks between when you eat. Which right now is, is, I'm not supposed to be fasting right now. I'm supposed to be eating right now, not eating, so. <laughs> How old is Anna? Do you want to answer that or should I answer for you? I'm 18. <laughs> answer for me. Anna's 18. Well, you can answer for yourself now because you're 18. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> she just turned 18. That's so exciting. God. What are you excited about being 18? What's your most exciting part? Doing whatever I want. Do what I want. Nah, Let's... really. Nothing's changed. Nothing? Nope. I can vote now, I guess. Yeah. You have to vote. Does this just look ugly or... Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> <laughs> the A looks good. Mm -hmm. Look at how bad this is. The A looks is good. Eating. It's all A. <laughs> looks good but are you not doing the sides um it's a lot of glitter okay well you don't have to i don't need to I'll use the glitter oh, that's what it's for oh, okay. to use, use if we don't use it it won't get used you're right you've kind of gotten over that part of crafting like you don't want to use all the stuff but you're like that's kind of why i bought it okay so Kind of like the E this way. Like, is it you know why? One? I think it's because if a project turns out ugly, you're like, ugh, I painted all the glitter. True, true. So, yeah, that's a dilemma. You don't want to use up all your stuff on, like, an accident. And then so you're like, now I don't have any more glitter. Exactly. But you probably weren't going to use it on anything else, so it's not that big of a deal. Exactly. And at least you tried. Exactly. Successful people fail. That's my biggest tip today. It's true. It is true. You're Unsuccessful right. people don't fail because they never try. You're right. Right? I got lots of motivational stuff up here. This just came from like me asking if I should use glitter. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is a teaching lesson, right? I don't know. So, has anyone been answering what their favorite? Nope, that's just fat. Someone said, did they see a baby bump? I'm just fat. <laughs> We're working on it. That's why I'm, I can't intermittent fast if I was pregnant. <laughs> yes. Uh, nope, that's called. The last thing we need is another Auntie Tay running around. Baby Auntie Tay. <laughs> that would make me another Mommy Tay. And no thank you. Oh my God. No. Okay, but I'm not in denial. Nope, no baby bump here. Man, the holidays are coming. <laughs> Holidays are coming, gonna eat food, get fatter. It's just what life is. It's what li you know, that's how you know you're over 30, when you have no shame in being like, nope, that's just that. <laughs> Before I'd be like, what? No, now I'm like, accepted it. I've decided I kind of want to be a pregnant model and not ever have to be pregnant. <laughs> How awesome would that be? You, you would never get a bunch have to of like, free maternity clothes. Free maternity clothes. You never <laughs> have to. I mean, you have to worry about your weight to an extent, but like natural baby belly, like after baby belly, is just acceptable. 
Like when you're pregnant, it's totally oh acceptable. Gosh. When you're not, you're like, oh. And the people joining right now are probably gonna think I'm pregnant. And nope, not. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Like, is that a thing? Can you be a maternity model without, without being pregnant? Yeah. Um, I didn't. I don't know. You would have to look like spot on pregnant. Uh, I'm one year postpartum, and two complete strangers have asked how far along pregnant I am. I was like, I, I know. I'm just bad. <laughs> It's true. Like, uh, we have to accept that, like, that is just naturally how your body grows sometimes after you have a baby or not even after you have a baby. Sometimes that's just how we grow. Well, and, like, women have an extra pouch so that we can have babies. We have an extra pouch? No, not, like, an extra pouch, but, like, an extra little layer of fat. Yeah, we're supposed to have insulation for babies. So. Like, our whole purpose on life is to have babies. Thanks. (laughs) (laughs) Like, really, I'm done, like... I don't know. It's one of those things. Okay, now I... My favorite Thanksgiving dish is the stuffing, someone says. Mine's cheese at broccoli casserole. But if I had to go with the traditional, it'd probably be... It depends, because I've had people's stuffing that is amazing, and I've had people's stuffing that's just good. I've never had bad stuffing. Right. Yeah, stuffing's pretty bomb. Some people don't like stuffing. Who? I don't know. I we don't need like, these negative people in our life. <laughs> I feel like I've heard I heard somebody say that, whether it was this year or last year. If like, they didn't like stuffing, stuffing, they probably just have so I don't know how you, I don't even know how you make bad stuffing. I don't know. I don't. Like how do you even screw stuffing up? It's so easy and so good. Ah, oh, thanks. With all respect, they think I'm beautiful. You know what I tell my husband? I say, I'm getting fat. And he goes, You're beautiful. I said, I didn't say I wasn't beautiful. I said I'm getting <laughs> fat. <laughs> Yeah. What does that have to do with anything but thanks? <laughs> <laughs> You're okay, that's not what I meant. Like, beauty and fat, they don't make, like, that doesn't make each other. Hello. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I mean, obviously, like, it can impose a little bit here and there, but please. I know plenty of beautiful fat people, and I am one of them sometimes. So it depends <laughs> on the day. Some days I'm just bad. Some days I'm beautiful. We need some more Mod Podge up in here. More Mod Podge up in here. It's raining. Do you guys hear it? I don't think you guys can hear it. Last week there was like a thunder truck imposing on my video. What? Like a garbage man? I think they were like moving stuff out there, but oh. it was super loud. A thunder truck? It was a thunder truck. <laughs> Remember? I was like, is that a thunderstorm? And it was just a truck and they were like, it sounded like an earthquake. An earthquake truck. Okay, so I'm on to the end. Should I just finish this whole thing on the video? Otherwise, I probably won't finish it. We should do it. Let's see. How long have we been going? It's because she's doing an intermediate fast. So intermediate fasting, yeah, it's not like a one-time thing. You do it for a long time, right? Uh, I mean, how long is it intermediate fast? It's pretty logical. It's, it's actually just something where like. You take breaks in between when you eat so you don't eat all day. Yeah, well, it's like... And it's like, you know how you're not supposed to eat right before you go to bed and, like, all that stuff? It's like after you eat dinner at, like, 5 or 6 or It whatever, really shouldn't even be called intermediate fasting. It should just be called, I don't eat after 5. Like, it should just be called how you're supposed to be. Yeah. <laughs> like, you're really not supposed to sit there and eat all day. Right. But, like, I, like I've heard people say, like, oh, I don't eat carbs after 4 or I don't eat after 5. I don't eat, like, I don't, like, that's basically what we're doing. We're just not eating after five. (laughs) And then basically when you wake up, you can start eating. But, like, you stop eating at five. You want to have, like, 14 to 16 hours of the day that you're not eating, which goes around, like, from five to eight in the morning. So that your body can take time to process all its stuff. Right. Because it's technically, like, after five hours, then your body goes into fat burning mode or something. But you still, I was reading up on it, you still don't want to, like, gorge during those eight hours. You don't want to eat, like, a ton. Well, the the better it'll work, I mean, if you... Yeah. If you, if eat, you healthy. eat healthy or you, like, just if lower you just your caloric regular, But intake. it's just whatever you're eating, you should eat it within that certain amount. Of time. You can lose weight by lowering your caloric intake and eating any time of the day, but, like, I think it's just another way to kind of boost your your fat burning or your metabolism and lowering your caloric intake like you don't I was reading this girl like eight she would she thought that like during the eight hours you could eat whatever you want so she would eat like three desserts and all like that doesn't work you can't do that so it's just a way to kind of monitor like how much you eat conscious or when you're eating and like yeah 
makes you not And I think it'll get easier. Last night was pretty hard. But I think it was also because we knew we weren't supposed to eat. We were like, we're hungry. Yeah. But it's just because we told ourselves but we couldn't But it's logic. Eat. Like, when you're a little kid, your parents give you dinner. You're not allowed to eat afterwards. Yeah, or you know they don't mean? even think like, about it. Right. Like, they're not, they don't, I don't know. My kids don't come in and be like, I'm hungry. Right. But that's what I mean. Like, it's just normal. It's just, we're not used to it. Yeah. You gotta get back on a regular. Temp for iron on to metal. Uh, I would put it at whatever the iron on says to do. Because it's not about the metal. It's for, well, no, the metal probably even heats up faster. So I think that that would be. Low and plenty. slow. No, I'm just kidding. Low and slow. Okay, so the D needs a center. I'm going to work my way through here till I get to the D. There it is. So isn't this so much easier than doing vinyl, though? Because, like, if you were to do vinyl on this, it would be, you'd have to use transfer tape. You'd have to do all that good stuff. It's kind of annoying. So we're crazy, someone says. Not so patiently waiting for my husband to get home from Alabama to get my cricket. Yay! What does your husband coming home from Alabama have to do with getting your cricket? As she, is he getting it for you? Or is he, you have to like, you guys have to decide if you can have it. Okay. Okay. So I have a lot more letters to do. Yeah, you do. How Friends. Long going? How long? Mm -hmm. Oh no. How long are we in, guys? Does it say? It says up there, 20 something minutes. Oh, sorry, I didn't steal your Mod Podge. Don't steal my Mod Podge! Okay. I snack all day, but good snacks. And yes, no eating after a certain time. My time is nine, I work late. Yeah, so basically they were saying like, it can be any time, but yeah, it just, just has to it, be. But just make sure to give yourself breaks. It's obviously easier at the time that you're naturally sleeping, because that's, a great time to do a diet because yeah. you're not thinking yeah most of the hours you're sleeping so it doesn't even matter right when we she first brought it up i was like 16 hours without eating but then i was like oh yeah you sleep like seven or eight of those so depending on how long you get to sleep some people if you get older you don't need as much sleep so like i technically only need like five to six i think now but i still love me some sleep okay okay i did two later Holiday season, holiday season. Do, do, do. That sounds awful. <laughs> that's what they said. Oh, that's what they said before they said that. Um, oh. To meet some nice people, I'm also giving away free socks. Yay! Let's go Pro TV is live right now. But guess what? We're here with us. Wait, I don't want to punch over this. This doesn't take as long as I thought it would. Ombre in it. Just wait till it dries, you'll see. Gotta be patient with this stuff. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's gotta come up into the... Yeah, the gold needs to go a little into the black, and then the black needs to go a little into the gold. This is a very focused craft where I can't read your guys' comments. We don't have a lot of after comment time. We need a comment reader. I can't eat anymore on a feeding tube, but I really miss sal seven later salad. That's, yeah, that would be a... We go down, you're not at the recent ones. No, I read the recent ones. Oh. And then I was trying to go up to the ones I've missed. I'm a stay-at-home mom and don't like spending that much when I'm away for work in case he has an emergency while he's gone and needs money. Very wise. Very wise. So when he gets home, you guys are going to discuss getting it, and then that's why you're waiting for him to get home so you guys can work it into the budget. That's a great idea. Great idea. We're going to go over holiday budgeting next Wednesday. So be here around this time, maybe. Be here or be square. Be, be there or be square. Be there or be square. By there, I mean here. Because if you're not, you won't be around. <laughs> I didn't learn that until like a couple years ago. I'm missing all the conversation because this craft takes too much focus. Because it takes too much speed. I've got to do it fast, otherwise it's going to dry. 
This is gonna be cute. My D's a little crooked. I put a low low. It's okay. Whoops. Thanks, Anna, for encouraging me. You'll be all right. <laughs> yeah, I. Okay, I'm gonna drape this down that way so it has some leverage because it's starting to pull itself down off of the side. Or I can drape it up over my computer a little bit. There we go. Then I won't see us, I'll just see the comments. I know, but he's freaking out, just overwhelming. I'm missing all the conversation. <laughs> no problem, if it's Who's paper type out? material, what check it first, the tape won't rip it up, but transferring to walls, canvases, ornaments, etc., works great. I love it and so much cheaper. Now that Anna is crafting with you, you need someone to read comments for you. Right. Do you have moderators on there still, other than me? Uh, I turned a couple people into moderators. Jillian, I turned you into a moderator if you're here. <laughs> Just letting you know, but I don't know if she's here. What is Anna making? Show me your craft, Anna. Um, I'm decorating this A because it's been on my desk for forever, and it's just a cardboard A, so I'm putting glitter on it. It's got Mod Podge all over it, though. It's not dry yet. It's actually a portion of, I bought them for T-A-Y, Tay. But you never did. And I think Hunter chewed the Y up, so I was left with oh, T yeah, and yeah. A. And then I was like, perfect, I have one and you have one. And then we were both going to decorate ours. I haven't decorated mine yet. Maybe we'll do that live. I'll do that live next time. I like live crafting together, though. We'll we should do this, like, more often. I'll do this. I'll just silently do my thing, you know. You don't so need to I be silent. What should I Guys. Know? Uh, what should I talk about? Send a heart if you want Anna. I feel like I'm talking to a spirit. <laughs> People, <laughs> send a heart <laughs> if you want Anna to speak. <laughs> oh, I'm totally uh, feeling the Mod Podge. Yeah, stop hogging the Mod Podge. Oh. Mod stronger. Anna, speak. They want you to speak. Yeah. <laughs> no, I brought you in here so we could speak together, so I'm not the only one speaking. I feel like I'm always the one talking. Yeah, shut up. And I'm becoming <laughs> narcissistic because all I do is talk Seriously. and wait for that. Look at three, four hearts, five hearts, six hearts. Talk. They want about you to talk. what? <laughs> about what? I don't know. Yeah. I'm sure they're asking you questions. I just can't read them. All right. Well, I'm doing this. What do you guys want to know about Anna? Q&A for Anna. Less about me. More about you. I was born here. To me is my aunt. That's about it. <laughs> I was born here. And I have an aunt. That's how I came to the world. <laughs> As an alien. This is how I did. I was found in a pod. <laughs> she adopted me as a niece. Adopted? <laughs> what if I you wasn't even related to you? can't have an aunt without a mom or a dad. <laughs> what if I wasn't even, like, related to you? That's okay. Oh, my God. I'll take you. I'll have it. Uh, where is here? Where is here, Anna? Sacramento, California. In the California, Northern California, IA. California, IA. I've lived here my whole life. Anna's moved all around the country. Yep. I've lived in Layton, Utah. Martian Creation says, Speak! Late in Utah, where else have you lived? Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, here. Lots of hearts. Orange Vale. Are you staying forever, Amanda wants to know? Um, I have no idea. I'm only 18. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. <laughs> Probably. Probably? Wait, I don't want that one. I want this one. You think so? You think It's a good place. We like it here. I like it here because here in Northern California, we have the best of all the worlds. We've got snow two hours away. We have the beach two hours away. We have cold beach. We have hot beach a few more hours away. We have mountains. We have valleys. We have rivers. We have lakes. We have sunny. We have winter. Like in Northern California, we have winter. In Southern California, they don't get winter. Mm. So, right. I mean, it's beautiful in Southern California, but it's expensive. And, like, spending Thanksgiving and Christmas down there is kind of sad because you're like, it's hot. Yeah. Like, I like my cold. I like the fall, the pretty trees outside. I showed you guys last week or something, I think. 
No, whenever I showed you the thing. I think I showed the trees in on my you need vlog to channel. Blue, blue I got black glitter. I blue dried this. Blue dry it. Red dry it. You got black, sorry. It's looking good though. I like how the black is slowly going up. Yeah. It's gonna look really cool. Just make sure you cover the whole thing. The whole thing. It's coming together. Size. Like, don't let there no. be little parts where there's glitter not. <laughs> I was gonna finish the sentence, but I realized that made. I'm but. hungry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's a question for the moms out there. Let's get some personal. How much time? How much fast food do you guys actually eat? Be honest. I want to know because I had a f mom friend post that they like ate Taco Bell finally for like the first time in like five years. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I'm pretty sure I've eaten Taco Bell like five times in the last month. That's how more. I felt before we went to KFC. Taco like, Bell's my jam though. Like I hadn't had KFC in like a good five years. I used to go there all the time with my grandparents. Yeah, but KFC is a hard, it's a hard... <laughs> It's a hard place if you are like calorie calorie conscious calorie conscious because they don't have a lot of things there that are low calorie or low carb or anything like that. Like I am pretty knowledgeable about the stuff at fast food that I can't eat and I don't even think about touching because like some things are like twelve hundred calories for one, and I'm like no no I'm not even gonna like put that on an option in my head, but. Mickey D fries are my weakness. Yeah, what's your weakness? Because I know, like, some people are like, I don't eat fast food. But then they're like, you you mentioned that one fast food place, and they're like, well, yeah, I do eat that one. So it's like everyone has one fast food place that they're like, I don't eat fast food, but I do eat that. Mine is Taco Bell. I'm like, I don't really eat McDonald's much anymore because I could do without it. It's the one place, like, if you could only have one place fast food. a week. Right. Or, like, your cheap place. Your like cheap place. Where like, would you go? Cause you know you like it, and it's, go to Taco Bell? and if you have kids, you, you know would use it on Taco Bell? you'd be rolling through the drive-through like, okay. here and there because you got no time. I love Taco Bell. McDonald's, but I don't know if I would Sonic. Use that. We don't have Sonic around here, but Panda Express. See, okay, okay, Panda Express. I think would be my one. But that doesn't count. Why? It's not fast food. You still yes, gotta it. walk in. You still gotta walk around the corner. You still gotta order, and you gotta make the conscious decision like, to are take you talking it about somewhere the places that or sit you know down that are, like really with the drive-through. Wait, like, I know there are some Panda Express that have that. They're like, that so Chipotle, sense? Panda Express don't count. They no, don't. Yeah, like, you mean, like, the places that, like, you know are horrible. That you know like, are bad. Like, Panda Express has option to get, like, steamed rice and yeah. vegetables and, like, those places that you should, know are, like, not using real food. <laughs> I know, that's all we're talking about is food. <laughs> we should go to Panda Express. We're from Sacramento. Oh, my God. Uh, our Pan Express has a drive through Yeah, so See? I guess, okay, I could, I, we have no one Panda down the street yeah, that has one, and you're right, you're right. I love, so I'm talking about places that have a dollar menu, that, places that are like those places that you're like, okay, I could feed my whole family for five bucks right now and eat really crappy, or I can go home while I'm but hungry. But like crappy, but good. Like, come on. Right, but good. Like, people would like. Would you really waste it on Taco Bell? Chick Fil A and our closest. Chick would I waste it on an app? What on a like, Taco Bell? Like, would you wait? You could only have like one fast food place once a month. The rest you had to eat healthy. Yeah, that's the hard. Month. See, I choose Taco Bell because they have easy choices for me to make healthy, like, not healthy, but if, like if low calorie choices. If weight didn't exist, like yes. where would you okay. go? Okay, that's a good question. <laughs> I would say Panda Express because. I would go if it had a drive through I would eat there every day. But I don't feel super guilty when What's I eat What's your once a, month, once a month place? Well, we eat at Panda Express at least once a month. I love Panda Express. And I don't feel guilty. I'm talking about those, you know those guilty places. McDonald's, so Burger King, Carl's places? Jr., I Taco KFC. Bell, Arby's, Arby's. KFC. <laughs> I gotta keep working on my craft, otherwise I'm just gonna talk about food and feel like I'm almost there. I'm onto this get part. Just get the it in the get being part. Chick fil A. Yeah. We can't feed our family for six dollars for under thirty dollars over there, but cost over fifty. Okay. So see, now this is the thing. There's ways to eat fast food and there's ways not to eat fast food. And this is why we do fast food a lot because we do budget. We do the dollar menu. We don't do like 
the meal. We never get soda. You do, but I like, and I do if I'm getting it for myself, but like my kids never drink soda from fast food. Like I don't allow it unless it's like one of those boxes and then they can split it or share soda because it just comes with the meal. But like the four for four at Wendy's, that feeds both my kids for four bucks. And they're happy. But my kids are also string beans and they eat like birds. So it's like if I had if I had those kids who could like inhale a ton of food and then they're still hungry, probably would not be going through fast food very often because it would rack up really fast. Do you have a blow dryer here? No. But that'll dry real quick. Just go like this with it. Like take the angle. Guys, I think I'm gonna actually finish this in this video if we if all technology stays good. This is fun. I can't wait to put it up. I have three key banners now. How does the side now. look? Oh god. Is it drying? That's what I'm gonna look at. It looks so cute. We don't have the dollar menu over here though. Who does it? Where are you? Move. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who doesn't have a dollar menu? Yeah, okay, when so I was a kid, ready. Whoppers were a dollar. Burger King Whoppers, man, see, I don't go through Burger King that much anymore because the Whoppers, now a Whopper Junior is like a dollar fifty, whereas Whoppers used to be a dollar. Yeah, My like, mom could roll through and feed all of her kids which for like five bucks. Which fast could you like not do without them? What is one where like you just would I could do, okay, let's start with the ones I could do without. I could do without McDonald's. Yeah. Although if you're needing a coffee, and you don't want to spend Adama. Starbucks money, Adama. McDonald's is, like, That's true. key. I have six kids. Yeah, so once you pass over that, like, hump of, like, is it it's way but cheaper to like, eat at home versus way cheaper know, to eat it here. even at Dunkin' Donuts, it's, like, two bucks for a coffee. For a, yeah, but we don't have Dunkin' Donuts. Donuts. Well, yeah, but when you do, like, in Raleigh, they right. have them everywhere. Have you ever made a card with dolphins or a boat on it? Nope. A card? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't make cards very often. We should do some more So how do you become a moderator? Liz, I'm going to make you a moderator. <laughs> Add moderator. You're a moderator now. <laughs> now that I have my computer up, it's a lot easier because you have to do it on your computer. But if you guys are always on here and you notice people and you want to be a moderator, I can make you a moderator. Um, the only thing great about Burger King is a $3 veggie burger. I've never been to Burger King. I've never I mean, I've been to Burger King. Sorry, I've been to Burger King. I haven't been to Burger King since they've had a veggie burger for three dollars. Is it three ninety five or is it three dollars? Because that four dollars for a burger is still kind of pricey. You can make burgers at home. <laughs> I'm so cheap. I'm so cheap. Up here in Canada, we don't have dollar menus. Yeah, because they're probably trying to keep you healthy. <laughs> we are like, make it cheap. Make it big. Huge. <laughs> like, and then we wonder, why is America obese? Right. Like, why do I want to be a pregnant model even though I'm not pregnant? Because <laughs> they give me the option to get a freaking $5 box at Taco Bell with, like, enough food to feed my whole family. Because that $5 box will feed me and my kids. And it comes with a freaking soda. That's horrible. I think I want to start a fitness journey on my channel soon. What do y'all think? What do y'all think since Anna's not going to talk? Right. Do it. Um, do, it. Uh, do it. Our do meal it. is over $5. Yeah, so like one meal is over $5, but like, so like I talk about, you could get like the $5 burrito or you can get a $5 box. It comes with a burrito, two tacos, a chip and uh, cheese. And a soda for five bucks. It's like, I when do, you think about I that, do? you're like, okay, I could do that. Should we put it on the ground? Yeah, we'll vacuum it. Okay. Or you, yeah, that's not enough glitter to have to try to save it. If it was a lot, I would be like, save that. Well, that's what I was thinking, but it's like mixed. I was going to do that, but it's mixed with. Oh, black. I didn't seal this one. Ooh. Anna, why'd you let me get away with that? Oh. Fires. Because I'm actually talking to you. You're women. fired. I could have told you that. Fast food is not cheap here. It's just easier than cooking sometimes. Yeah. Well, okay. So, and then there's places like Chick-fil-A that don't have cheap. Yeah. I'm and not so, really like, when me and Anna rolled through there the other day, it was 20 bucks, And I'm like, $20? We could have eaten at Starbucks and gotten a coffee and a sandwich each for that price, you know? And it still probably wouldn't be $20. Nope. I don't yeah. think so. Plus, Chick-fil-A makes me angry. <laughs> it 
does. It has some chemicals in it that makes me moody. I don't know what it is, but it does really bad. But I like Chick-fil-A. We actually camped at Chick-fil-A overnight and got free Chick-fil-A for a year. Maybe Thanks. your body just hates it because it's had it so much. Yeah, it's all quit putting this in my body. I do not drink tea or coffee. I only drink Diet Coke. It cost me nearly 25 for three adults. I don't know what that means. <laughs> and one Happy Meal at any takeaway places. 25. Here. I'm guessing that's quid or pounds. Quid? What? They say quid. Who does? I don't know, in the UK, I think, right? I don't know. There's got to be someone from the UK. Back me up here. You guys say quid, right? What is quid? I don't know. It's I like a generic, it's like bucks. Means. Like how we say oh, okay. dollars and bucks. What is their currency called? Euros. Euros. Quid. Euros and pounds and bob. I don't know. In UK, even Happy Meals cost three quid. Wow. I'm guessing, but three quid is three like bucks? five dollars. Oh yeah. Yeah. Because okay. their their money and our money is different. You right. I'm in Shelbyville, Kentucky. First time watching. Yay! Is there anything you can suggest I can make with the party foil? I made those clean spiral things and sound and some flowers just to put on the table. Don't know what else to make with it. Party foil? What's party foil? Is it? Party foil. Party foil. Tin foil with uh, birthday confetti on it? I have two kids. Anna has none. Except two when I give her mine. I'm gonna give them away to her sometimes. That's fine, and then I just don't want to be on my own. Yeah, good. Like, good idea. Kids one so day. my kids are halfway finished cooking. They're almost adults. <laughs> They're not almost adults, but they're like halfway to being not kids. They're actually more than halfway to not being kids. They're closer to being teenagers than they have years of being kids left. Crazy talk. That's wild. Life goes so flipping fast. Faster than this banner goes, that's for sure. But I did well, if you have hard teenagers, it'll go by real slow. <laughs> what? If you have hard teenagers, it'll go by real well, slow. Well, yeah, having hard kids, you'd think it'd go by slow, but it still goes by fast. No, they're not hard kids, but all kids are hard. Having kids is hard, regardless of how good your kids are. Cricket makes it. Party foil. Will you look up what party foil is? Sure. On cricket.com. I think it's... Cricket party... Non-adhesive foil. Cricket sells it. Um... Is it the one that's like reflective? Non-adhesive foil. Oh, so it's, it's this. It's there. Remember the really like holographic? Yeah, but it's not adhesive. It's paper crafting. This would be fun. You could cut out the letters like this out of it instead of doing this whole Mod Podge glitter shiny. thing. And then you could um, glue, them on there. glue them on. It would be shiny. That'd that kind of cool. sounds fun. I could have done this with paper. I could have just put these with paper on this, but I wanted cool. to show you guys yeah. this technique. So, good thing this is in order because I'm sure I would have screwed it up. I'm going to finish this. Yay. I can see the glitter on my nose, like, glistening in the light. I can, like, feel that I have glitter all over my face. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's on your forehead. It's my life. <laughs> <laughs> I can feel the glitter. How do you get vinyl to stick to canvas for a stencil? I have uh -huh. not been able to get it to work. You just got to work it really slow. Hold back at a Vinyl? 90 degree angle. You don't. That's hard. You don't tell them they don't. They can do it. I mean, they can do it. It's We've done harder. it. Yeah, we As have, a stencil right. for a stencil. Oh, for a stencil. Then, yeah. yeah. Not to stick forever. Um, maybe adhesive spray, like what Katie uses. If you were using paper or, but not. On the canvas, just right before, just to make it stick a little bit, or no? No, because the vinyl's already sticky. But barely. Sometimes it's sticky. You use transfer tape. Sometimes it doesn't come off. You use transfer tape, but peel back at that 90 degree angle I always talk about where you yeah, hold the stencil true. down at the same time as you peel back. So you peel back. Um, I feel like I need to do a video on that because I've heard a couple people ask that question and having issues with it. Maybe we'll do a live one. We're going to be doing some live crafting with the gifts I'm gonna make for Christmas. Oh wait, can't forget to seal this before I take it off. What I did. 
Mm. Look what you made me do. I stick vinyl to canvases all the time. Yeah, it, you can stick it and even use it. We did it for our um, password on our Wi-Fi bath. That's vinyl. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Anna's right. not impressed. You're right. It's doable. Don't ever tell my viewers they can't do things, Anna. This is a world that we can do it if we try hard enough. And if we can't, we're gonna figure out a different way. Positivity, positivity. You need one more letter. No, I only have one more letter. I could do this. I could do this! But thank you for looking at me. I get it. Emma! You're gonna need more, but whatever. No, I'm not. Who's the master crafter here? I signed up. Hmm? Hmm? Who's the one who's lived in North Carolina their whole life? Hmm? My whole life, yeah. Well, okay. While I've been over here crafting my life away. Uh, and what product would I use to make the cling? To make the cling? That would be awesome. Have you tried cutting birch wood on the maker? No, I've been waiting for the knife blade to come out, but they're taking forever. Watch, it's probably out, I just haven't checked. Is it out yet? No, because the knife blade is really what everyone's kind of waiting for to do, start doing some major wood crafting, but I have not, I have not done a lot of wood stuff and I need to. I'm gonna, that's my goal for 2018 is start branching into some more of those categories that everyone asks about that I haven't done, like the pens, the sealer, the clear sealer, the, the all the good stuff. Anna's like working over here now, she's not even crafting. I'm done. I'm sorry, I'm faster than you. Sassy. She did an A. It looks great. Let me see it. It looks awesome! Come on, at least use a word that starts with A. That does it cool. It's gonna it's gonna go nice. Be all shiny when it dries. Okay, seriously, let's finish this video because I'm hungry. <laughs> and I only get eight hours to eat. I seriously I'm not kidding, I wanna I'm hungry. I'm um, not kidding either. You think I joke about this stuff? Do you think that the new knife yeah, blade would do vinyl records? I hope so, plus the, um, no, 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 this isn't my pudge. Oh, you are hungry. I knew that. I said I was going to help you. Where's the Mickey stuff? I don't know. We'll find it. Calm down. Calm down. Over there. Where? Here, she's going to put the Mickey together. Good luck. I don't know what parts of those go with what or what it is what. These are just squares. I don't know. I don't think that's part of it. That's... That's it? That's the... It's just a hat? No, there's a buckle somewhere, too, for his hat. Just do the Mickey head at least in the hat. Use it like a sticker. This is vinyl? Yeah. Mm, this is so we cute. We more paper stuff. I want to do a paper project. Okay. What do you guys want to see Anna do next? Yeah, what paper project? Because... I, I think the new knife blade will cut vinyl records, and I'm really excited about that because I've been wanting to try that one because the maker is 10 times more pressure, but only with certain blades, and the knife blade is one of those. So, like, you'll notice you can't cut 10 times the amount of pressure with the regular old blades. It only works for the new ones because the old blades can't handle that much pressure. You can't handle this much pressure! says the maker to the knife blade, the old blades. <laughs> you make everything in oh, the bully. The air will cut halfway through. Yeah, it needs more pressure and more depth, and I think the knife blade will really, will really do that. So, where Got my mystery box yesterday. Where are we I supposed to cut? Mail. What? No. I'm not sure what those are for. I don't think those are for this. So then put his hat on, and then he has a little buckle that goes on it. I saw somewhere. There might be one more piece, but I don't know. Um, is there a certain date the mystery box comes out? No, we never know. We only know like a couple days before. What did you do? Don't rip it off with paper. Oh. Hold that. He's too high. No. He's too high. Don't. Anna? If you break him. What? What are you going to do if I break him? 
it. He was too high, just a little too high because his hat was sticking off. Give me that. Thanks. Okay. I would have probably used lighter for this so that you can see his hat, but it's okay. He's cute. Okay. So that's done. I'm going to take some fancy pictures of this when it's dry and with the leaf. Anna, will you grab the leaf banner so I can show them what I'm talking about? Because I'm just like saying it. I'm not showing them because I'm bad. She's bad. She's bad. You know it. I always miss your lives. And by the time I see it, the boxes are sold out. I know. I know. I need to get better. We get told about, sometimes we get told like as they're arriving and sometimes we're not. So then this also goes with this banner, which we used all the faux leather from the mystery boxes in. So if you have a wonder what to do, and this just uses the regular deep cut blade, so you can cut this with that. So I'm gonna drape this somewhere in my house and I'm gonna take some fancy pictures and post it on the blog. But next week, we're just doing a talk time video how we budget for the holidays and tips and tricks and all that good stuff so you guys can um he has a strip and a hat and a buckle I wonder if it says we'll find it there'll be pictures eventually he has a strip and a hat and a buckle somewhere is it vinyl yeah is it? yeah it's vinyl i think it might still be over there somewhere i don't know We'll put it in together, oh, right? It's I such a it. cute leaf banner. I found that. Yep. So technically we learned something. We learned that our patrons have to be patient because when you upload photos to Access, they're not shareable anymore. So all of the stuff that I've been saying has been shareable to my patrons hasn't been shareable to my patrons. So we're working on getting all the stuff that we've made into like graphics or in ways for you guys to use them but this will be one of those ones that is available i believe okay so i'm gonna put a little so the nice thing about vinyl sometimes if they're just solid pieces you can use them like stickers so we're making him a little careful. i love how concerned you are about how i craft and i'm the master crafter it's crooked it's crooked it's Anna. cute it looked cute crooked it looked off a little bit He's a pilgrim. Can you guys see that? He's a pilgrim. And then we have the, wherever the other guy was, I showed you in the beginning. And it says Friendsgiving. Look for pictures on the blog soon. It's got to dry. This is really, really cute. <laughs> Do I recommend buying all the blades for the Cricut Maker or just the deep cut one? Um, well, right now there's only two blades and the rotary blade. So there's the three blades. But... Yeah, I would, if you have the maker, you're going to want all the blades that it has. And then it's going to be coming out with new stuff all the time. So, um, do I have an idea what will be in the Cricut Black Friday box? I don't think there, I'm not sure if there's a Black Friday box. box. I have not gotten word. And, uh, but if I do, make sure you follow on Instagram because I will post a picture if it does. Because I'm, I can't show you what's in the box until it goes live on the website, but I can tell you that the box is coming, so you guys can be looking for that. I posted on Facebook and Instagram. So I didn't even use up that much glitter for this. I used, I added, I used almost the whole thing. I used it to there, but I still have a good amount left. So one vial of Martha Stewart glitter, a little bit of Mod Podge, and a brush and some paper and then optional vinyl if you want to do the little guys. Pretty easy, pretty easy. But if you wanted to do it fast, you could do glitter paper for the letters and just glue them on. That would be a lot faster, but I just wanted to show you guys this technique. You could do this technique on lots of different things probably. My Instagram is anti underscore Tay, spelled just like my YouTube channel. Um, yeah, so I think it's lunchtime, yeah? Yeah, it is. <laughs> now that all that talk of food, we're hungry. So, um, we will be back Wednesday, or I and my husband will be back on Wednesday, and, uh, and or Anna, and or just me. Someone will be here on Wednesday morning. Okay. Yeah. For some reason, my husband makes really amazing videos with me, and people love them, so trying to weasel him into more videos. Uh, is Anna Griffin having a Cricut Maker bundle on HSN? I have no idea. 
all this stuff is kind of secretive sometimes and they only let us know when it's like ready because I think they want to make sure that it's like 100% ready to go before they let anyone know about anything. I plan on getting the Cricut in a month or two, but I tell my daughter one more time I can make them with the Cricut, she will kill me, <laughs> Oh well. I heard that too. Yeah, so if you heard it, then it might be a thing, but it depends who you heard it from. So, rumor says the 17th, Anna Griffin will have an HSN bundle. Okay, we're gonna go. We love you guys. Um, I get my first Cricut maker tomorrow. That is super exciting. You wanna go turn that off? Sure, so we can leave. Love you guys, bye! Do I hit X? I don't know.